Hi everyone. So in this video, I will be talking about many doubts re uh, regarding TCS NQT 2026 and many students are asking so many things. So I will try to explain each and everything. Also, I will give you a 15 days preparation plan in this video. Okay, make sure to like this video because we will be discussing about many things in this video. So first of all, many candidates are asking the exact registration process and the next process. Okay, so first of all, if you have registered on TCS next step, okay, if you have registered, uh, reg registered on TCS next step, I just want to ask one question. If your application is completed, okay, after completing the application, you will see an option called apply to drive. So this apply to drive will be exact uh, thing in which you will apply for TCS NQT 2026, okay. And your TPU will be providing you the instructions for this. Okay. So I hope this process is completed. After it, only thing which you need to do is wait. Okay. Many candidates are asking if we are applying, is there any shortlisting? So no, there is no shortlisting. That means if you are applying to it, definitely you will be getting a fair chance to attempt the test, whatever your resume is. Okay. Second thing. Uh, Admit card and hall ticket, exam center and document. So exam center, so I hope you filled the exam center, right? In your uh, apply to drive option. So whatever you have filled in the exam uh, center, you will be getting the exam center near your, near your location, okay? Now date and everything matters a lot. So I will be explaining to you all these things, okay? So admit card, hall ticket and documents, what are these things I will also explain, okay? So what is admit card? So first of all, this is the first process in which you will be getting an admit card mail like this. TCS NQT All India Batch. Here you will get as 2026. Okay. Here you will get the date admit card download. Okay. So this kind of mail you will be getting. Please be informed that the admit card of TCS NQT, which is scheduled on Saturday, July 5th. So this kind of date you will be getting. Okay. Uh, is now available to download by log login at your link below user ID and password. Okay, so when you will log in on your TCS next step portal, you will be getting your admit card when you will get your mail like this. But the main important part is when you will be getting this admit card. Okay, so basically, uh, many TPOs and uh, 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 inform to the students around around 15th of November, we may expect the TCS NQT exam. Okay. But the most important thing is I'll just explain you 15th of November maybe will be the first phase. Okay. First phase or around 15 November will be only the first phase. It will not happen together for all students. This process can take the time up to one month. Okay. So for different, different colleges, it can be for different, different dates and based on your exam center also and based on your reason also it differs okay so don't worry if other students got the test and you have not received because you will be also getting the test but the first phase will be around 15th of november and after 15th of november uh, uh, there uh, will be the multiple phases okay multiple phases and multiple shifts but uh, I, I, I am just hoping maybe they will ramp up within first or second week of December the exams okay because it is a on-campus opportunity so they will not take it for uh, uh, for long so maybe if they are starting with 15th of November all of you may be getting the chance maximum of you will be getting the chance before 13th uh, 30th of November only so there could be five to six phases and generally the gaps between the phases is around five days. So if the first date is 15th of November, then next will be on 20th, then 25th, then 30th. So something like that. Okay. So is it in phases? Yes, it is in phases and the difficulty level of each and every phase is different. So this is also important. Okay. For each and every phase, the difficulty level is different. The questions are different for each shift and each difficulty, uh, each uh, basically phase. Okay. So it will be in phases. Don't worry about it. Okay. Now, why should you focus on PYQ and wettage? Now, understand this part. Okay. So for TCS NQT, actually, the first main target of uh, the first main target should be 
the foundation section okay now in this foundation section there are total three things we all know there is quant there is the reasoning okay and there is english now tcs nqt actually emphasize a lot on pyqs okay now what is pyq pyq is basically previous year question so mostly they follow something like a same pattern in which they ask the questions and the weightage which they asked previously also for an example there's a topic called si and ci that is simple interest and compound suppose they asked two to three questions in 2025 from this topic so this year also it will be very close to two to three questions okay because suppose if you are getting 20 questions in quant it is not required to solve all the 20 question only you need to target between 12 to 14 okay so first we will complete the most important topics and the pyq based questions how can you do that so i'll just explain you okay then we will talk about the preparation plan for next 15 days okay so i'll just uh, explain you okay first you need to make the consistency so all the instruction of the wettage so suppose i have explained the si and ci uh, ci wettage is more so you need to practice it okay how you will get all this information how you will get the instruction you need to join this whatsapp group which is tcs nqt whatsapp group in this whatsapp group you will be getting the instructions related to quant reasoning english everything you will be getting okay and the daily test for practice okay so because consistency is very very important okay you daily need to practice quant reasoning uh, verbal okay so here we are adding the daily practice set you can see here from 15th of october we started you will not get any single day in which we have not added the test okay because daily practice tests tests are ongoing for the students and students are doing very very good and the most important part all these tests are timed based timed okay so you will be getting a timer so in the timer only you will be solving the question after solving the question you can see the solution as well so if you have some doubt in any question you can see the solutions as well okay so this will be the thing after it we have a lot of questions available here so which i was talking about that as that is the previous year okay so two mock tests here complete mock test you will be getting here based on the pyqs one also we will be adding so there will be total three mock tests with pyq and five mock tests for practice okay so five mock tests uh, for practice and two mock tests for pyqs you will be getting here okay then reading paragraph very important that you will be getting and see here already we have added more than 800 questions here where in these basically in these section practice set uh, practice set quant practice set reasoning and practice set verbal okay so in these three sections basically in these three sections you will be getting more than 700 questions okay more than 700 questions you will be getting for your practice in verbal reasoning and quant with a high level of difficulty also sheets you will be getting here coding all the previous year coding collection okay also one separate book with all the mnc's coding sheet you will be getting so a lot of things are available here which you can use for your practice and it is only available uh, uh, available at the price of 199 so you can join it you will be getting the instruction on the whatsapp group also that how to prepare so it will be helping you a lot okay not talking about the next 15 days plan so as i have mentioned you don't need to focus on all the topics okay the main thing is you need to know the weightage and the proper question like what kind of question tcs ask okay so that difficulty of question you need to practice for the next 15 days it is not very difficult to crack it in next 15 days because suppose in next 15 days you will practice daily around 30 questions okay so 30 to 40 questions mark easily you can do in next 15 days if it is previous based you are doing it properly definitely you can crack it okay so 15 days time is enough to crack tcs and qt but you need to practice the question with the timer timer is very very important okay so this timer is very important because you can solve the question without any timer but that will not help you because only thing which is hard in tcs nqt is the level of the question second thing is time the most difficult part because some questions are lengthy so you actually need to have timer before for the practice okay 
so that you will be getting in the mock test the link will be in the dis description so pyq weightage based practice you need to do that also we have provided okay so this pyq and weightage based preparation if you can do in the next 15 days also daily practice the coding question at least two to three coding question you can do daily okay so 60 70 questions is good enough number uh, for cracking your digital also maybe you will get prime okay so in the next 15 days you need to give your 100 percent you will be solving the question based on the weightage of the important topics you will be using the timers and you will be solving the daily topics okay so link will be in the description of the mock test i hope i cleared all your doubts okay and uh, i hope these things are clear thank you so much for watching